Hi, Kelly Clement here from Metastock. In this video, I'd like to talk to you about a feature that many of our RT customers have been asking for for years, and that's the ability to be able to scan, backtest, and forecast in any time frame. So currently inside of, inside of Metastock, you're able to go in, pull up a chart, and you can set it and bring your chart into any custom time frame. So for example, if I wanted a 75 minute bar or an 80, 88 minute bar, I can do that and just easily pull up the chart. The problem was you couldn't scan for that, you couldn't back test it, and you couldn't forecast it. So now with uh, some of the new enhancements to Metastock 15, you're now able to do that. So here we have our 75 minute bar, but again, I wasn't able to scan for any signals or, or back test or forecast anything. So now when you're inside the power console, and you go into the Explorer, for example, you can now come in and you've always had the one minute, five minute, 10, 30. And if you're, if you're working with a daily charts, daily, weekly, monthly, quarterly, you didn't have this custom option. So now you have this option where you can come in and say, I want to scan on a 75 minute bar, click OK. You can run your scan and get any signals here. So let's just uh, come in here and look for a MACD buy signal. We'll come down to our index constituents down here and look at the S&P 100. And now what we're going to do is just run a scan on that 75 minute chart and it will go through and pull up any, any buy opportunities that are now having, happening on a 75 minute chart. So we'll just go ahead and let that run for just a second. You can see we're, we're processing that through. So far we don't have any results back. Okay, doesn't look like we're going to get any signals right now on the 75 minute bar, but that's okay. So if you have, if you're looking for those time frame setups and you're trading specific time frames, you can now go in and do those explorations. Again, same with the system tester. You can now come in and set your interval. You have to have some uh, security selected here before we can show that. So we'll just grab a list right here. And now you can come in, select custom. Again, if you wanted, if you were doing a 75 minute exploration, do a 75 minute system test. And now you can also do that in the forecaster as well. And that's one of the ones that's been a big, uh, a big demand by our customers is the ability to do a forecast in timeframes other than daily. And we've just launched that out in Metastock 13. So if I was pulling up a chart right here, uh, if we were doing Apple, again, we'll just stick with our 75 minutes since we've been talking about that quite a bit. We'll do a 75 minute do OK. And then when I launch the forecaster, it'll bring up that chart in a 75 minute. So this is a this is a pretty big deal for our RT customers and also for our end of day customers who want to do multiple day or multiple week bars. So there's a lot that you can do with this and now analyzing in multiple time frames and getting a lot more robust with that analysis. Uh, I hope you found this uh, video informational and uh, I hope you enjoy using these new custom time frames uh, settings inside Metastock 15 and thanks for t taking the time to watch this video.